guys, what's up? Mary here. Welcome back to my planner channel. So for this week's video for my plan with me, we're going to be doing a just over talking thing. But right now you can voice over. That's what I was trying to find. Um, but this is my spread from last week. I used a kit from Planning Roses called Frozen Marble and I absolutely adored it. I don't know why I turned that sideways. Um, I was trying to show like both sides of it. So I zoomed in a little bit. You can tell there's a lot of tasks that I did not do, which is fine. Um, and then this is the kit that I'm using this week. This is a kit that I actually made myself. Everything I made in Photoshop myself, except for the rainbow, because I was too lazy to make the rainbow, so I just googled an image for a rainbow. Because again, it's for myself, I don't care. Um, and you will notice my little things are quite large, and the reason I did that is because it's a lot easier to cut. So my tidbit for you, if you're ever going to make your own kit just for yourself, and you're hand cutting it, make it, make the little things bigger. It's a lot easier to cut. Uh, one of the todays got messed up for some reason when I printed it, so I did end up making an extra one. And um, But I made to-do headers and boxes, which are attached because it's a lot easier to cut. And yeah, I made everything myself, St. Patrick's Day colors. And yeah, I was kind of, I'm really happy with how it turned out. Um, originally everything was green and I didn't have the yellows and the blues and the reds, but I was looking at other St. Patrick's Day kits and I noticed people were incorporating colors from the rainbow. And I thought, wow, that's actually really smart. I should do that too. So I ended up fixing it. But here we're just setting up. This is for March 14th week. Um, I just kind of set them down really quick for the to-do headers just to see how they looked because I wasn't 100% sure how I wanted to do them. But I decided to do green, red, blue, yellow, and then repeat because I only had one yellow. Um, so here I am just putting it down. And the reason I decided to do a voiceover this week instead of doing like commentary while I'm recording it is because my boyfriend um, worked or did not work today. So he was home and we share an office and it's just so much easier <laughs> to just um, record when no one else is home. Not that I don't mind him being home. It's just a lot easier because there's a lot less background noise and stuff. And he was having issues with his computer, so I wanted him to be able to play his computer and play games and stuff today. So I decided to just kind of do a little chill one and just do a little voiceover and just talk about some things. Um, I did end up not purchasing a Cameo this week. Um, it was no longer on sale at Michael's, so I decided to just wait. Um, they're about $2.30, $2.35 on eBay. Uh, for a new one, for the exact same one I was going to get from, from Michael's for the same price. So I might get one when I get paid. I did finally get paid on Friday, thank God. Um, and then I should get paid again because they took so long with that one, um, hopefully another week or two. So I might wait until I get paid again and then buy one, but I am definitely going to be buying a silhouette. Um, I really want to get a new printer as well, so if you have any recommendations for a printer, please let me know. I think it printed everything pretty well, except for the yellow. Um, it's a little grainy. But you can't, I don't think the camera really picks it up that well, so that's okay. Um, here I'm working on the today headers and the backgrounds for them. Um, I just set down the St. Patrick's Day one, but you can't actually see it because I'm an idiot. Um, but there's another one. I ended up not making a weekend banner for this kit because it's kind of hard to cut them out um, in the style that I wanted to make them in, so I just decided just not to do one. I mean, I know when the weekend is, I'm not too concerned about it. I do love a good weekend banner, but. I'd rather just not have to deal with it and try and cut it out and then just get frustrated. And then I also put the look of the Irish up in the corner. I thought that one was probably my favorite background that I made with the rainbow. And then um, I just made the uh, pot of gold and stuff in Photoshop. So I was pretty, pretty happy with that. And I might also be making a kit next week for Easter. I meant to buy a kit. Uh, Planting Roses had a really nice Easter kit and I meant to get it. And then I kind of just forgot. <laughs> And I placed an order with her today. Um, I'm recording this on Sunday because that's when her restock is. But I didn't think I'd get it on time. So, because it takes about a week from Canada to get here. So I decided to just, I'm probably just going to make my own. So we'll have another custom kit next week. And then after that, I have a bunch of kits that I bought. Oh man, I bought so many stickers on Friday. Payday ended up being a spend all your money day because I bought so many kits. Here I'm organizing my little things and my half boxes just to make it easier to grab them and set them down um, so that I wouldn't, I don't know, it's kind of hard to pick them up off the little table thing. And here I'm setting down the stuff for Monday, but you can't actually see it because I'm really good at videography, which is funny because it was part of my major. So, haha. -ha. Um, but I set down a YouTube one and a TV icon because I upload my plan with me on Monday. And then I have a main channel video on Tuesday and a TV show. And then I originally put a YouTube video thing on Wednesday 
for some reason. I don't even remember why. And then I realized I meant to put it on Thursday, so eventually I move it. Um, I am going to be recording an Etsy haul this week. I don't know if it'll actually be up this week, but I have. Um, I just received a Glam Planner order on Saturday. I should be getting another Glam Planner order on Monday um, from a kit that I purchased recently. Um, the one from Saturday was a pre-sale, and then I should be getting on Tuesday an Organizing Companion. Um, I should be getting a Planning Roses this week, a bunch of others this week. So I'm pretty excited. I have so many orders coming in. It's not even funny. And I keep ordering more. It's it's a problem. It's it's an addiction. I'm here. I'm setting up my washi, which actually turned out pretty perfect, except for the one on the left side. Somehow it ended up being too tall, which I'm not really sure how that happened because I made them both from each other. So I don't, I don't know how that happened. Um, I don't think you can really tell too much, but eventually I do end up cutting it. Um, I just didn't show it on video because... I don't think it'd be that exciting. Here I'm cutting up the washi backgrounds that I made and figuring out how I want to place them. Um, I also realized when I was editing this video that I forgot to cut out my littles header. Like I did make a littles header. They were red and they were supposed to be on top of the little things and I just completely forgot to cut them and I completely forgot to use them and I didn't realize it until after the fact. But I kind of like it without because it's kind of hard to cut them anyway. So eh, whatever. Um, they're not really necessary for the kit, so I kind of like it without it, um, just because it's a lot easier. It's really hard to cut headers, because they're so tiny, and I can't cut straight to save my life, so you can tell some of these are a little bit off. You can see a little bit of white space poking through, but, you know, it's whatever. Is it that hand touch, I guess? I don't know where I was going with that. But here I am just setting up more of the washi. Some of them I just did the full strip because it was just easier than just cutting it down a little bit like I did for that one. Um, so it kind of blended in it into it just a little bit. So it wasn't like a huge deal. Um, some of them it's a little bit more obvious than others, but whatever. And I tried to place the half box in between so that it wouldn't look as weird so you couldn't see that line between them. Obviously, I didn't do it for all of them. Some of them I did it on top of the little things because there was a little bit of white space. So here I am doing my sidebar. I made a to buy, an Etsy one, and a YouTube. The Etsy one is for like happy mail that I'm getting this week. There's so much. It's not, it's, it's a problem. Um, and there's so many orders that I want to place. You guys should see my cart right now. Actually, my cart was at like 20 something and right now it's a little bit less. So that's actually good. But I set down a little bit of the washi. Um, and then I start to add the Etsy one, and then I realize it didn't really fit. So I fixed everything, which you can't really tell because, again, my angle is, like, totally horrible. So it ended up covering the washi, so whatever. But there is some rainbow washi at the bottom. My camera ended up cutting out when I was writing stuff down. Um, this week I actually worked 8 to 4 because of the time change. Whoop, whoop. Instead of working 7 to 3, which is nice. Um, I added the cleaning day sticker is from Dizzy Daisy Dreams. The TV sticker, because Daredevil comes back, heck yeah, is from... Planning Roses, the first, um, the Instagram sticker is from Dizzy Daisy Dreams, the second Happy Mail sticker on Tuesday is from Planning Roses, the Editing Day laptop sticker is from Thumbprints Co., the Monday Happy Mail sticker is from Glam Planner, and I put that there because that's when hers is coming, um, and then I added that little mail sticker on my Etsy thing um, because that is from Dizzy Daisy Dreams and I thought it fit, and I couldn't fit all the orders that I'm getting this week, that's like how, that's how many I have. That are supposed to be coming. Um, oops. <laughs> it's a problem. It's a problem. But see, eh, whatever. And I ended up not really filling this whole thing out just because there was some stuff that I wasn't sure that I was going to do. Like, I know I want to get my eyebrows done this week, but I wasn't really sure if I was going to do it Tuesday, so I just wrote it down there. I also stopped using the Twitch stuff at the bottom because, um, I don't know, I'm going to track it in a bullet journal instead, which I will eventually make a video on that. And then um, tomorrow, or Monday, when you guys actually see this, I should find out if I got the job offer that I had an interview for last week, so my fingers are crossed. Um, and then I write down all the videos that I'm working on this week, just so I have a kind of in a list. And that is pretty much it. Um, some days are like completely blank because I haven't filled them in yet. Um, I still need to figure out like what I want to put and stuff but I was really happy overall with how this kit turned out again I completely handmade everything except for the rainbow in Photoshop and then all the other stickers that I use from other shops I will link all those shops down below they're shops that I've been using for a while 
And yeah, I think that was pretty much it. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. I put out planner videos every Monday for plan with these. And then if I do another video, like an SEL or something, that's usually on a Wednesday or Friday. Um, I might have one coming out this week, but I'm not sure exactly when. But be sure to follow my Instagram, my planner one, and you'll see because I'll take pictures of all the mail that I'm getting. Um, and all those are linked below. But thanks again for watching. Um, and I'll catch you guys later. I hope you have a great week and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. All right. Bye